Hey, what's up y'all? It's Gary with 110 Scale and back to show a little bit more progress on some more RC areas at the new property. So this area, I'm not really sure exactly what I'm going to use it for. Um, not the steepest of hills. I, I think it might be good for a U4 area. So, um, but uh, anyways, yeah, let's uh, take a look. Alright, so I brought the ATL with. Little goat. So here is the entrance to um, the wet weather creek. Uh, it takes a whole lot of wet weather to actually make it a creek. Haven't seen it a creek yet in the six months or so that we've owned it. But um, this actually has the potential for a decent bouncer hill. Um, and see here if I can kind of, you know, wherever the ATL is, kind of make that the edge of the hill so it doesn't get too easy. Um, have the bouncer start up over here, make a dash one side or the other, past the boulders there, down the creek bed, and then back up. Um, not the toughest of hills there, but it could be a good little speed run. Um, make them have to do a U turn up top. And then come back down maybe have the down come back through this little tighter portion of the creek bed here but this is one area um, this whole little section over here down the wet weather creek would I think make for a really good U4 track if I can figure out how to see and get enough stuff cleared um, or a tough truck challenge maybe but whatever I use it for, this area is going to be used. Let's go down this way and take a little look back up. You can see here, get rid of the rest of the sticks and stuff like that. But um, pretty decent elevation, elevation changes, lots of jaggies. And the same thing over here. Uh, again, lots of weed whacking and uh, clearing to do. But that is that cedar will go away there. And then these hills over here, or these rocks here, once cleared, um, dug out a little, maybe spruce it up, should make for, again, either maybe part of a U4 track or just make this the crawler hill. With all the natural boulders here, um, it wouldn't take a whole lot to make this an area where we can just kind of, you know, come down the creek bed, go up and around, into there then you can see here this whole area as well opens up rig down here so we've got just past those cut cedars is the top of that little hill where the atl did the u-turn so you follow the wet weather creek down here with a little bit of trimming and a little bit of work this whole area could be awesome has a little crawler section roll a couple of extra big boulders in dig out a little get rid of all the grass lots of work but i think this could make for a good crawler section back here definitely needs to be made a little more difficult but with what i got here i think this could be this could be the perfect little crawler spot on the property and it's secluded 
um, almost as far back away from the road as we can get here, about a quarter of a mile. And then over on this side, decently steep, it's not a very tall hill. So this, I think, especially with the big slabs, could be an awesome little crawler spot over here too. Again, yeah, I'm not really sure. God, this thing's just a little goat. Spider monkey, goat, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> ATL on portals. Kind of a point and shoot rig. Need to get me that uh, that new Hilo they just came out with. That Hilo 2. Refreshed ones. So yeah, so anyways. So this is going to be another RC area here on the property. I just need to figure out what I'm going to do with it. Get rid of a whole bunch of cedars. Trim the grass. Start digging some rocks out so it's a little bit steeper. But uh, yeah, that's going to be it. Alright, thanks for watching. And remember to like, share, and subscribe. All that good stuff. Y'all take it easy.